My name is Brenda. I work in public programming at the Royal Saskatchewan Museum. And, uh, I like to bring out a fossil that I've been working on. And now, a few days ago, we sent out a teaser trailer asking if anyone could guess what the fossil is that I'm working on. The fossil was kind of hidden under uh, some bubble wrap. And uh, well, we showed some of the tools, the table, and there was a clue in the scene as well. Now, I'm curious to see, did anybody pick up on that clue? Now we're gonna take a look and see if you were correct in your guess. All right, let's take a look to see if we can find that clue that I mentioned on that was on the table. Does anybody see a clue? How about right there? Did you notice the little turtle? If you did, very good watching. Um, now I'll uncover to see what we have. It is a fossil turtle. So this fossil turtle was found in the big muddy area of Saskatchewan by our museum paleontology department. So this turtle, when I received it, it, would have, it had a lot more dirt um, piled in there. And of course there was, it was fully encased in a plaster jacket to protect it. Um, a plaster jacket was cut open and then I started working on the fossil turtle, removing that dirt that we don't want. An example is this area right here. You see that gray stuff called matrix? We don't want that. We're trying to get rid of that so that we can expose more of that really nice shell that we see under here. And then along around the side of the shell as well. I have to be very careful because it is quite fragile, quite delicate as most fossils are. Um, you see here is all broken bits. This area is very thin, it goes right through. And all the way around over here is also very delicate, delicate so I have to use quite a bit of glue as I'm working. Um, we have B72, which is our glue thin so that works good for securing those areas like that that are very crumbly and then we have thick glue that is used to, to stabilize and make pieces stronger hold them stronger together um, I'll keep working at this um, exposing more of the shell more of the spine you, see, you can see the spine here Eventually, I'm going to have to secure this side and we're going to flip it over and work on the other side. So I think that'll give us a really good idea of um, what this turtle looked like millions and millions of years ago. So I hope you uh, check online for updates. Have a good day and Junior says hi.